I see you. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. Who are you? None of your business. Are you gonna hurt me? Only if you're stupid. Get out here. You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. I ain't gonna ask again. No, that's all I have. That's it? How'd you make it this long? I'm serious, what else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me, I'll pop you. Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around, come on. Please stop. Give me that hat. No. Where'd you get it? I asked you a question. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Not like the last people I got. They had all kinds of good shit. That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. You're just a little fish. You gonna cry, little fish? This your daddy? What a bozo. No. What? We just fucking started the episode. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. <laughs> That was deadly. Sup, craft kid, if that's your real name. Krista, talk to me. <sighs> this will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn. It's more smoke than flame. At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. It's okay. I can wait. <sighs> All we do is wait. And for what? You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... We can't stay in one place too long. It's too dangerous. We need to keep moving. All we do, all we have ever done is move. 
but we never seem to get anywhere. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet. Then ice. Then snow. It won't be easy. It'll be better there, right? Safer, maybe. So they say. But I don't know. It has to be. I know it will. We'll see. We just need to keep moving north. We need to get to Wellington. We'll try the best we can. <sighs> now I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit. Still not enough. The flames are too low. This will never cook. This might burn. This won't burn. This will never burn. It's too wet. Let's 
The flames aren't high enough. I'm by myself. Bullshit. He's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, guys. What the Krista, fuck? Krista, run! Hey! <laughs> Wow, she managed to keep her hat. Good news. 
Krista, are you there? crow food right now. Pine trees, man. They're so legit. Which way do I go? Nothing but trees. Oh shit. Crows mad. They're everywhere. <gasps> What's that? Fox. A cat. Dog. Dog. It's okay, boy. It's okay. So, where are your owners? Are they around? If they are, I hope they're nice. <laughs> What's he doing? <coughs> hey, what'd you find, boy? <coughs> where are you going? Wait up! Looks pretty run over, but you never know. Let's look around for some food. Looks like it's been here for a while. Looks like they were a happy family once. I hope they left some food behind somewhere. Nothing edible. <sighs> hmm. 
No food here either. Hey boy, what's the matter? Shh, we have to be quiet. Wanna play? Wanna play catch? Fine. It's your decision. Do what you think is right. It's not much of a tent anymore. I bet scavengers tore it apart. Think anyone's been sleeping in here? I can't tell. be something good in there. Brains. Oh, God. No food on the grill. Nothing in the cooler. Ugh, I hate scavengers. They take everything. Oh, shit. I did not see that. It's okay. He's dead. Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. It's okay. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. It's okay, boy. Shh. He can't hurt us. Think he had himself tied up? Or did someone force him to do this? We just have to stay out of their reach. I like to think that if they were alive, they'd probably want to help you. Nothing. Poor guy. Pretty sharp. At least we found something useful. 
We won't go another night without food, okay? Wanna play? Wanna play catch? Okay, bring it back. Good boy, good boy. To check everywhere. <sighs> well, here we go. <gasps> oh, my God, thank you. Look, a can. <laughs> Let's see what's inside. Please don't be bad. I guess you're pretty hungry, too. Here you go. Hey, you don't eat it all.
they smell the blood, man. Run. Oh. I think, I think we're safe. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? I, I think so. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Hmm. Well, I'm Luke. And this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. And it's nice to meet you, Clementine. Now, for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! Ah! What? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, 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 what are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back. It was, I swear. Swearing doesn't make something so... No, 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 I'm telling you the truth. Please. Hmm, all right. Let's see it. Whoa, 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 hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this. Now, what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I... I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... you don't kill dogs. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Of course I am. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at... All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened to... You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on.
Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. I'm just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Ah, oh, shit! Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. Hey! <laughs> You're lucky my nephew can't shoot for shit. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard that. You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? She tried to run, man. Well, Nick, can you really fucking blame her? We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. <laughs> it's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Damn, that must have hurt. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would saving her life then what how would we know it worked just let carlos have a look first you want to be sure right you don't want to do something you're gonna regret i'm on your side kid no need for a guilt trip who's she sarah what i say stay inside I don't mean to cause any trouble. I just wanted to find help. But if you let me go, I promise you'll never see me again. And where exactly would you go? To find help somewhere else if I can. Look, I may be in the minority here, but my gut tells me she's telling the truth. It probably is just a dog bite. Probably. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that? Could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? Oh. We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. We have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, with it. please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shed.
It was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yeah, okay. uh, I can't believe this. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Oh, what is this? A platform game? <laughs> Yo, hammer's a deadly weapon, man. Probably preferred. Kill me. They have a doctor. He's gotta have stuff for stitches. Well. It's pretty safe in there. It'll be a good place to stitch up my arm. Needle peroxide and some bandages. Oh shit, we we're going on a stealth mission. Go, 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 go. 
open window. Open. Shit. Open front door. Now they'll see me. There's gotta be a better place. House meeting in five minutes. Best. Best. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Oh, fine. has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. She opened the door. Is that really my only option here? Dude, this is extreme.
Done the same. It wasn't the brightest idea. Oh, and firing your rifle was, huh? Next time we'll just put up a neon sign that says Lurkers Welcome. Where are you going, huh? I want to get my sweater. We'll be going in a minute. Pretty sure that's where I came from. Or maybe? I guess so spotted. Just open the front door. It's too easy. Come on. It's just the front door is the only thing that's real. Ow. I think it's getting worse. Either we go back through there or we go through the front. Let's try the front door then. Any weaker. 
clean. I'll still need some bandages, and it's something to keep it from getting infected. Have medical supplies around here somewhere. Oh, on here. Pretty sure that's it. That man sometimes. Shower, shower, shower. Damn it. Just need to have this baby. <laughs> Secrets, man. <laughs> Controversies. Alright, let's go. Go, 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 go. Bedroom door. That's risky. You're not supposed to be in here. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Help me, and I won't tell him. I... I'm hurt. Please help me. I, well, I shouldn't. You. A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. Your dad didn't care if it hurt or not. He's willing to let me die. That's not true. Has he let people die before? Well, I, I don't know. Not on purpose. I don't know. You can help, you know. I need something to clean it up, and something to wrap it with. A clean bandage. My dad says we're out of real bandages, but I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this applies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be super cool. Yes. We are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Do you promise or not? Come on, I said yes. It's not the same. <sighs> Promise, yes or no? This is gonna come back and bite me. <laughs> yes. Oh shit, back out. Peace, swear. Uh... If I help you, will you leave me alone? I don't want to get in trouble. I'll get the stuff my dad uses when I get a cut. I think this is it. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't.
Thanks, Sarah. Peroxide. Not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. All that. She's got a bottle, a hammer, a needle, some bandages, some big pockets. Stitch ourselves up. This is going to suck. First, you use the peroxide, I'm guessing. Oh, that burns. <laughs> Fun part. Okay, now we'll grab the needle. Boom. Now, just like last time, just how Krista showed me. Just a short.
I did it wrong. <laughs> My uh, my uh, trauma center mechanics coming to work. Good enough. Now we use the bandage. Get in here. Little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? Are you happy? I could have died, you know. Well, you didn't. I just needed some help. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to Says us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. Well, screw you guys. You shouldn't have locked me in here. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn lurkers sneaking around out here. We better get inside. Lurkers? You hungry? This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. You wouldn't have done what you did. What do you mean? You manipulated my daughter. 
I asked for her help. She's not someone you can just ask for help. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, but there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. She needs to grow up sometime. You do not know what she needs. Rebecca was worried you might be working with someone else, that your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure, you are not to be trusted. Stay away from my daughter. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. Definitely. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. What happened? Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. I... It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand. I do. Yeah. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. You let yourself heal up, take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Hey, I'm sorry. I... I shouldn't have asked. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them. But they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. 
He taught me how to shoot a gun. What uh, happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone, but he saved me first, lots of times. Well, sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah, he was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm, wouldn't that be nice? You're still here. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. I'm a little girl. You know what the hell you're doing. We got enough problems, and we don't need any new shit. Get it? Got what you came here for. Now go. Damn, what time is it? Twelve fifty. How you holding up? I heard you got an ear. Time out, time out. Someone here. Yo, Bango, are you alive? From Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. What's her problem? Yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. Put the volume. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. My friend Lee taught me. That's good. It's important nowadays. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. What a baby. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me, and of course the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Cause you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well, I didn't know that. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him that. Uncle Pete! 
Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. What the hell is that? Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down! We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! What if someone's alive, Nick? Who cares? Cause they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. <laughs> Come on, Clem. You wanna be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. You'll fit right in with this outfit. Look, just keep your head on straight. Same deal. All shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. Oh, no. Good. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. What happened to you? <coughs> you were in the woods with Krista. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell me! <coughs> Please. Fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. 
God damn it! Lurkers! I'm out of ammo! Come this way! Ass, bitch! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of you! I'll cover you! We gotta get out of here! Get over here, God damn it! Can't you listen to me once? Just one time? I've got ammo! Listen to me, damn it! I see a way out! I'll cover you! I've got a clear path over here, god damn it! <laughs> Holy shit. What happened? I didn't choose the side? Aw, oh, that's stupid. Redo, redo. <laughs> I think it froze. Maybe. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Lurkers! I'm out of ammo! Come this way! Bitch! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both I'll of you! I'll cover you! We gotta get out of here! Get over here, god damn it! gonna do someone's outside someone came here looking for you a man what did he say what his name was we know damn well who it was who is he one of the guys we were with before what's he gonna do Can't keep going. I figure we got about four, or five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Oh, there's gonna be some revelations next chapter. Did you save Krista? Did you give water to the... Did you save Nick or Pete? Fifty two percent of players went Pete. Okay, not bad. 
except for the water tank and everything. Let's see. Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh man, I already saw the credits, man. I think I'm gonna stop here and maybe play Heartstone or something. I think maybe tomorrow. We'll do the next chapter. <laughs>